The worst thing about back knee is not being able to pick at it effectively. Back knee is one of those things that drives everyone crazy, whether you're male or female. And I've suffered from embarrassing back acne for years. They don't really know why some people get more back knee than other people. They do have theories that some people are born with larger oil glands and also more oil glands, implicating a more genetic component. My pores are huge. The worst thing about having back knee is having back knee. There's no like, one thing is worse than the other. It's just, it's all bad. During the teenage years, back knee is usually due more to hormones. Our hormones kind of drive our oil glands and with more oil production, then acne can kind of act up. I got back knee when I was like in late teens, early 20s. Back knee definitely started in high school when everything was terrible. Sweating can also drive acne, especially when you've been going to the gym a lot because you build up a little bit more bacteria, which again contributes to inflammation. Nowadays, I just get them when I'm walking to work and it's really hot out and I sweat a lot. You can't escape it. You're sweating on a subway, you're sweating on an elevator, you're sweating everywhere, and it's terrible. The biggest tip I give people, especially for people that are going to the gym a lot, is you should work in a benzoyl peroxide wash. It's both anti-inflammatory and also antibacterial. So having that in your shower is a good tool just to kind of prevent. Some people notice that with a lot of sugar intake, acne can act up due to a lot of inflammation that can be caused by the sugar. Acne is a part of life and you just have to be confident and deal with it.